In Ecuador, the lack of credibility and rejection towards the government of Guillermo Lasso increases in the midst of new denunciations for the alleged links of these political operators with drug trafficking and the Albanian mafia. Our correspondent in Ecuador, Henry Pillajo, with the details. The image of President Lasso's government has not recovered. His few public appearances and his speeches on national television have not been well received by the population, especially in the context of the allegations of corruption involving his trusted men, including his brother-in-law Danilo Carrera. This is a government that has had little credibility on a regular basis. It has been politically beaten by the elections, and in the face of allegation of corruption, it reacts in the most chaotic way. It is a government that is desperate and has no capacity or credibility for action. The changes and ministers' resignations in the government do not seem to be a solution for the social and political crisis. The changes that have been made are not enough. What we are looking for is for the president to really create policies in favor of all citizens in education, health, and public safety. So far, the president of the republic has not worked for the needs of the Ecuadorian people. Analysts point out that the government's weakness could deepen if it does not implement policies for the benefit of the people. Right now, we don't have political alternatives or democratic solutions to this crisis, which is evident due to the weakness of the government and by all the scandals that are coming out. At the same time, new accusation and interference of Guillermo Lasso's closest men, who would have links with drug trafficking, are being reported, convincing evidence based on which some assembly members are seeking the resignation of the president or to request an impeachment trial. The links that Mr. Danilo Carrera has with Mr. Ruben Cheres and Mr. Ditan Hig Albanes with the Albanian Mafia and drug trafficking, we are working on that. It will be presented by the Commission, and what we are looking for is the impeachment of resignation of the President. In the wave of accusation, representatives of social and student organizations in a more radical position begin to raise their voices in protest. Our position is one of absolute rejection and of demanding the Lasso step down, that he resign from his post. The resounding no vote of the Ecuadorian population has practically turned into a revoking vote to the government of Guillermo Lasso. At the same time, the temporary commission for truth, justice and the fight against corruption, in the outrageous case called the Great Godfather, continues to meet with former government ministers as part of the investigation process. Henry Pillajo, Telesur, Ecuador.